Hello, welcome back. My name is Vasco the Gamer. This is Vampire. So, even though it's the middle of the day, let's go. Grand Gigno or Gino? I don't know. It's grand anyway. Grand. Some grand. <laughs> I need to get down one floor and then get to her. The only thing here is though, if I go down here, oh, it's through here. It's locked, all right. Damn it! How do I do this then? Uh, I don't know. Find a way. Seems to be a point where. Yeah, I know. I get that. I just need to get to you. There we go. Behind the scenes. Who are you? You who dared enter my realm. Vasco. Are you here to worship or mock me? I'm here to put an end to the vampire epidemic. Ah, but Doris Fletcher is no more. She was consumed by this putrid flesh that now enshrouds her. You feel anger for what happened to you, but I can help you. I'm a doctor, Mrs. Fletcher. Doris Fletcher is no more. All that remains are the dreams of the queen she was. And the queen shall be. I got that. All shall die. For that was her final wish. Sure. My blade arise and save your queen, my I begin with this move. Level 30, okay. This could be a hard fight, but then again. I have plenty of hard fights until now, so. Uh oh! Why do you tend to hide? Uh oh! I smell your fear. There we go. Full health, full blood, and six seconds. I need stamina quickly. I have nothing I can do right now. Okay. I need to get rid of that filthy one first. Thank you. There we go. Oh, we can find out here. That's good to know. There we go. Two and a hit. That's good for me. And also, I have this move to you, my lady. Nice, I got a saber. I did not come to kill you, Miss Fletcher. Will you spare me then? Save this cadaverous carcass of mine. Does your heart 
Beat a little faster now. You fancy me then, Doctor? No, Miss Fletcher. My dead heart will beat for only one. Ah! Is she pretty? Is she sweet and tender? To me, yes. Ah! <laughs> I hate her already. I know. And this is partly why you must be destroyed. You just said that I did not come here to kill you, yes. But I realize now the threat you embody must be stopped. Yep. Oh no, are you setting this place on fire? This part is going to be lit. Will I be remembered? Will you? You the greatest actress of her generation. No one can take that from you. Good. Thank you. And farewell. Burn, baby, burn. Oh. So. Farewell, Doris. Why did the fights up to first or three fourths out in the combat? I wanted to mull you down, woman. Bravo! So dramatic. I love it. McCullum. How strange I seem to find you whenever I'm inquiring about that scal infestation. I mean you no harm. I'm not I here do. for you. But once I've put all the pieces of the puzzle together, I'm sure we'll have a little chat. You and me. Stay away from me, McCullum. You and all your war dogs. That I can't guarantee, Dr. Reed. But I'll let you go. For now. Gyudo would have had no chance against her. I should probably leave the theatre right now. Uh oh, uh oh. Why are you both against me, dude? Well, I can understand it since I'm the strongest of you. I take you out at least first. One at a time, please. Just so we. Because I need to focus on you. Otherwise, that could happen easily. We're the same level, you and I, this time. Miss me! Bad doggo! Bad doggo! I need seconds just to realize. Not again, you f bad doggo! Did you get your health back as well? My turn! Yeah, you got your health back immediately. So we're not so different, you and I. Stay away. I said stay away. You're not a cute little dugger, but you're still a dugger to me. I would like having to do this, but you give me a little choice. I don't need to continue this fight much longer though. That's up to you. a few seconds left oh thanks for the health dude that helps there we go yeah no it's a quarantine here that was easy enough as long as I have that ability I can get through most situations or tough enemies. As long as I can survive. Uh, Red Grave? Where are you, sir? Sheffield. There's Lord Red Grave. Just 
Welcome back to the Ascalon Club, Lance Bearer. Please tell us the good news. Have you put an end to the epidemic? My hypothesis was correct. Doris Fletcher was the source of the contagion in this part of town. She was probably the first to be infected. Yeah. You cleansed her before the hunters, I've been told. Well done, Dr. Reed. You thrust your lance and pierced the very heart of the corruption. That sounds a bit dirty, but that's just me. I'm just a doctor. The important thing is, we won a major battle for the survival of London. For Thank the you. Week. Thank you, my lord. Now, I have another task for you. One of the utmost importance. Which means, done by yesterday. Even more so than the previous. I'm listening. It's time for you to perform a most sacred duty for the club. Okay. I want you to recruit a new vampire. Recruit a new vampire? Are you sending me on some sort of diplomatic mission? Not exactly. I want you to make Aloysius Dorsa the Ekon he deserves to be. I'm not sure. I'm not sure I'm the best candidate for such a task. I can hear the hesitation in your voice, Dr. Reed. I admire a man of principles. I'm basically killing a man. In this matter, there is more at stake than your moral compass. It's not a moral question, Lord Redwood. It's the responsibility of giving immortality to a man I barely know. Nonsense. True. Aloysius has been a member of the Ascalon for years. This is but the fruition of a long-held plan. How would you like me to proceed? Aloysius is waiting for you at the Dawson Estate. Once the deed is done, I'll join you there to celebrate this momentous occasion. Questions I first. Go, I have a few questions. All right. I'm listening. How shall I proceed? Would you like me to proceed? Don't worry. Aloysius has had many years to prepare himself. He has studied our kind for decades. I just give him my blood. So shall I just let him drink my blood? Yes. Aloysius will gratefully suck on your blood. His heart will slow, then stop. But he will rise again as one of us, an immortal. I feel that's a very good idea though, but sure, but there has to be a danger to it. Is there any danger? Our blood alters a mortal body so deeply that some don't survive the metamorphosis. True. They die for good. But Mr. Dawson has been preparing himself for a long time. I've been playing for about an hour or so, and I think it's time to end the episode here. That drama queen was a tad bit hard, but then after leveling up, she was just medium difficulty. So, as long as I just keep myself on my toes and always have my back ready, I should be able to defeat the next one as well. Anyway, thank you all for watching, and if you liked this episode, please remember to just check out the marrow out of that like button. And i see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.